This is oop, this is fatal frame, Rob. Did you think we'd be doing this like ever? No, you convinced me. I'm pretty sure you convinced me pretty strongly at the the end of the last one that this was never going to come out again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure I was optimistic, but you shut me down. And I was like, well, maybe he's right. I'm glad and... I'm glad that you believed. I did not. I was a little pessimistic. Because like this was only playable. Uh, fan translated and emulated poorly trapped on the Wii yeah but uh here it is English ported I believe in Koei Tecmo's ability to kick the can down the road and keep saying if this sells well maybe we'll make a new one <laughs> for all their shittier and shittier titles <laughs> yeah but did you think Made in a Blackwater would have sold well no did it I don't know uh it must have sold well, sold well enough for them to justify this. I mean, Maybe I, they didn't have to do much do much work for this. Yeah, I guess so. Which uh, which begs the question: Do you think this might be a step back from Maiden of Blackwater? I don't know. We'll see. Because uh, Maiden of Blackwater came after this, so you think that this wouldn't be as good? Like they'd improve a bit on it. So, uh... oh, we got a. Am I going normal? Am I going normal, Rob? What's the what? What do we usually do? I'm pretty sure we usually go normal, don't we? We went normal for the last we, one, but went easy. We for went the first easy thing. early on, but yeah, normal. I, uh, I I think I'll trust in normal. Yeah, it's probably it's probably safe. So that all three ghosts are visible. What do you mean? I where is? I only see two. Oh, there's one under the table, on the far on the bottom right. Yeah, and then there's the boy probably, in the middle. Is. And then there's one sitting at the table in a chair. Is there? Oh, I see it now. Uh, it, right here is probably fine. This game is a work of fiction. On... Yeah, that one was like right, right in the way. Yeah. So it's it's a quinky dink if you see anyone you know in this. No real people. So, uh, thanks for coming back for this one, Rob. I appreciate it. I like watching Fatal Frame. I uh. Madoka. I appreciate you uh, doing this Let's Play with me, and I will release the hostages as, as, as soon as the playthrough is over. <laughs> I appreciate it. I love them very much. Uh, I know. That's the only way I know I could get you to play this with me. <laughs> Yeah, shut the hell up, Madoka. So, like a lot of people, I don't know shit about, like, any of this one. Because, like I said, this one was locked to the Wii in Japanese only, so I just wrote it off completely. I Is this one even referenced in the new one? Like, there was a bunch of returning characters in the... Yeah, like we... Made the Blackwater. Yeah, we had Miku... And uh, they they referenced. Uh, the, 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 well, it didn't yeah, have they, Miku, but it well actually, yeah, no, it did have Miku. Older Miku. It had like a bunch of a yeah. bunch of them in it. it. It referenced a couple in the text, and it had Miku. But uh, yeah, I guess I guess we're gonna find out exactly how this one is linked to it. Am I in control now? Nope. <laughs> this view, that that particular shot really implied I was in control. So I started twiddling the sticks like, oh, that's that's what a video game looks like. Oh, that's on me to press X. I was looking over at my uh, OBS. It's been so long. Well, it's not going to seem like long since we did this because Fatal Frame 3 is coming out on my channel right now and will be followed by this. But we, we played through Maiden of Blackwater as soon as it came out. So this is like months later and I don't even know if I'm recording any of this correctly. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hope I didn't fuck this up completely. Uh, okay. You can use the oh, okay, or don't let me do that. Objectives may update as you progress. It may update. Fuck you if it doesn't though. Um, menu screen. If you're ever unsure what to do next, give it a look. Okay. I okay. hope it just never updates. Yeah. Oh wow, I move slow as shit. Photos lie scattered on top of the cabinet and in the drawer. The photos have the photos have faded and are no longer recognizable. Well, that's a shame. I move so slow. Oh, that we got a quick turnaround. I pressed in L3 because in shooters that's run. 
<laughs> yeah. And I wanted to go fast. It's useful. The notice board is covered yeah. in old photos. The photos have faded and are no longer recognizable. <laughs> Sensing a, th a theme here. Also, pressing down doesn't back up. It just spins me towards the camera. Fuck, I forgot how awkward these games are. A rusted yeah, newspaper no, rack just... containing several ancient looking newspapers. The paper crumbles to the touch and the print is too faded to read. One might describe it as unrecognizable. Is it one of the top yeah. buttons run? Oh yeah, I found it. Oh, now I'd, we're running. I'd hardly call this a run. I think I walk faster than this by default. <laughs> Ooh, there's spooky masks here. But you gotta be in the right place. They're sinister masks. Recognizable? I don't think so. Hollow vacant eyes seem to be laughing and crying at the same time. Yeah, when you laugh so hard you cry. None of those look like they're laughing. Yeah, they look like they're laughing and crying at the same time. <laughs> Old screen doors piled up when used. Oh! Found her. Yeah, there she is. We can Don't go home. That. Objective. <laughs> yeah. Well, they just erased the objective. Never mind. Yeah, it's uh, it said in the menu, but it didn't tell me how to get to menu. That is oh, I thought it was in the top left. I didn't notice it disappeared before. Oh, here's menu. Oh, no, I still have to find her. Find Misaki asshole. Okay. Well, yeah, I'm already doing that. Well, automatically follow. Well, I hope so. <laughs> well, I don't want to leave the camera behind. Oh, L3 or R3 for quick turn. Interesting. I'll never remember to do that. I'm not like a horror game guy, so I don't do quick turn. I just turn around slowly and suffer for it. Too useful not to do. Do you think we're going to have a GPS like we did in the fourth one? I really hope so. Yeah, that would be that would be nice. Once an hour goes by and we don't have GPS, I'm going to have to ask you to look up a guide. <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> Is that Misaki's flashlight on the floor? Why do we have to be really dramatic about this? Just pick it up. Your flashlight illuminates dark areas and helps you investigate your surroundings. No, it's not Misaki's. She's... Right there, opening a door. Misaki? 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 What's going on? Do you know what's going on? What was on? that? It was just... Was uh, that her? Yeah, it was Misaki. Was that the was... other girl? No, was... no, that was her looking for Misaki, but there was a cutscene where she opened and closed the door. Aren't you in the same spot you were before the cutscene? Yeah, like right here. What the fuck? I'm not sure what you're confused about, but I'm also just confused in general. It just played a cutscene of her going through a door, but we're in the same spot. No, that was the other girl. I think you might just be racist. She said Misaki. Yeah, like she saw her and just said her name. But she's Madoka. Yeah, I'm Madoka. And Madoka She so said Misaki? Misaki? So it was Madoka that went through the door. No, Mad Madoka looked at Misaki and then just said her name. I didn't see Madoka <laughs> or Misaki. Yeah, that was her just now in the cutscene. We looked at her. Oh. If only I had the key. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that, that was not a very clear cutscene. It, Rob, come on. It's, they both look the same to you. It's okay. I get confused sometimes. Do they, do they look the same, yeah. though? To you, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, in not... this, are they wearing similar outfits or something? No, the other lady has more, has a more chesty outfit and has, like, transparency on it. Like, she's wearing something more sheer. And I have something oh. a bit more conservative on. I gotta find the key. That much I can tell you. Yeah, this, uh, we don't know anything about these girls or why they're here. We just know that we yeah, were in a I photo. Yeah, really don't know who they are. We know that we were in a photo and we don't want to end up like the other ones that were in the photo, I guess. This door? Oh, not that door. Who 
Who's there? Well, that must be the way to go. If I understand how video games work. It's like a hotel lobby. Yeah, we don't know what this building is. <laughs> it seems like a hotel. Like, maybe downstairs those are like some... No, it's seeming less like a hotel every minute. Uh, it could, could be. I don't know much about hotels. This looks like a secret door. One section of the wall is separated from the rest. It doesn't budge when pushed. Well, we'll try pulling it, dumbass. There's like a tiny little button looking thing next to that door that you investigated. Yeah, I did see it and I chose to ignore it. I'm glad you're here to keep me on track. No, I don't think it's uh Yeah, no, no, that ain't happening. Stop. Jesus Christ. My belief that this is a hotel is growing in strength. Yeah. I mean, I don't have any arguments against it. It's it seems hotelish enough. <laughs> Where every single room has a secret door to get in. Yeah, like every every room is connected one way or another secretly. Oh wow, <laughs> this. Ugh. I'm so used to playing third person shooters that are just like we already we have the third person shooter formula down, so it's like good. Yeah, but Fatal Frame, the controls have always been in a, in a realm of their own in Fatal Frame. And it's a realm that isn't emulated any other time. So it's always jarring to come back. Well, that's clearly the way to go. Excuse me, ghost. I'm looking for the key to Misaki. I wouldn't mind if you could elaborate a bit more on... Oh, look at this freaky-ass pic. Look at this picture. It sucks. You put that in the newspaper? You can't put that in the newspaper. I don't think it's newspaper. You scare all the kids. It looks like oh, a newspaper. Oh, yeah, yeah. Thing. It's kind of a newspaper thing up there. Well, you know what? Oh, you got, you got all chunky. I can't see. Oh, that's okay. It'll probably clear up in a sec. I got, like, this weird filter is implying something, but I'm not sure what. Oh, it's implying that. That lady kind of looks like a nurse. Do you think this is a hospital, maybe? Uh, yeah, yeah. The curtains part to reveal the room's interior, but it's too dark to make anything out clearly. Or maybe it's like a some kind of combination hotel. Hotel. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be the worst. Just mixing patients with the uh, <laughs> yeah guests. I'm just I'm just gonna slip out of the room and go grab some ice for uh for our drinks <laughs> and there's just someone on a fucking gurney. There's no one here. You can examine the various objects found in your environment. Objects that can be examined will glimmer when you shine your flashlight over them. Ah. Is that like a clothes store through that window? <laughs> what is going on over there? That's a good question. What is, what is why are oh they're uh, hanging yeah okay. nurses uniforms and other items are scattered inside the display case okay. that, that's where we put them <laughs> in the display case <laughs> people's names yeah so pretty sure this is a hospital now right i think we've just yeah. just about we've figured out that mystery the game implied that there'd be something glimmering I mean, it wouldn't tell me that and then not give me something glimmering in my flashlight to interact with, right? I would assume not. Oh, there it is. A little hard to find, damn. Not big shimes. After you pass your light over, you can reach out with your hand to examine it. Oh, this is this mechanic again. Oh, this old mechanic. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Stand next to an object with a circle icon will be displayed. Corner screen, press and hold circle to reach out your hand and examine the object. Stop reaching out for the object. Let go of circle. I didn't know that this wasn't a... Uh, was, was, was that a Made in a Blackwater original? I guess it's a, this original. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I didn't know that the, it wasn't original. Something is written on the paper. I've put the key to the museum on top of my desk. There are a lot of irreplaceable objects in the museum, so please take care to keep the door locked at all times. It's a museum now? It's a combo hotel 
Hospital <laughs> Museum. I've got to find the key. Oh, so it's definitely in here. This is a desk, right? Or is it not? This is a desk. There it is. What's the meter on the bottom right? That's a good question. Uh, Ivy Power Key. There's the museum. It's the room that What's Her Face went into. Square to open the menu screen. From there, you can view the map, use items, view records. You can also press options for map screen directly. Okay, thank you. Uh, I don't see any meter, Rob. It was there before it disappeared. Well, there's this isn't being recorded, so there's no evidence of that. So you just seem like a crazy person. Miss <laughs> <laughs> Tunes. This song sucks. Play Frozen by Madonna. I wonder if this is intended to be scary or just annoying. Ooh. Well, peace. Oh, there we go. Thanks for not letting Finally. That, yeah, thanks for not letting that go on for too long. The music. I'm so glad it stopped. I have to forget. Mm -hmm. It lingered there for so long that I thought it put me in control again. It's a... Uh, this game is truly meta when I can't even trust myself or what I'm seeing anymore. Thankfully, this place has been so straightforward, I know exactly where I'm going. And that'll be the first and only time I say this if my recollection of how Fatal Frame games go is uh, correct at all. I mean, at least Blackwater had the GPS thing. Yeah, that was awesome. I was really it's not the, was it was it the, the third one that was just a you had to run around like miles and miles to get to the next place yeah when we did the playthrough of the third one i cut out hours yeah that one sucked <laughs> yeah well i i <laughs> navigation really yeah one was not good. i i really liked three but yeah navigation in that was fucking terrible it was so yeah. hard because you'd have to like like to get like to the room next to you you'd have to go in like the opposite direction for a while up some yeah. stairs uh towards uh, and then further away and then down some stairs and reach around and where am i going oh right here yeah it was uh that place was a labyrinth and i did not appreciate that labyrinth appreciated literally every other aspect about it though damn shame who's that oh it's the music lady that was her favorite song. She didn't like that I was trash talking it. You wouldn't understand, man. You haven't listened to enough music from that genre. It's about the annoying sounds it's not making. <laughs> what the hell am I looking at? <laughs> Is this through like a door window? Or yeah, is that through like that? one of those like frosted glass windows? Yeah, I think it. Or looked... was it like a reflection on the floor? Or... I think. <laughs> what the fuck was going on? Yeah, like I don't know if it was just like a spooky filter on the camera, or if it was like <laughs> <laughs> like just a weird glass style, like some frosted glass or something. Rob, I think we need to get more in the zone. I don't think we're supposed to be laughing as much as we are. That is not the intent. Oh. <laughs> This is a seat. This should stop being so funny. <laughs> a collection of old books. The name Kunihiko Aso can uh, just about be made out in places. Oh, that's the last name of our friend, Misaki. 
You must be some kind of connection. Oh, it's another hole. Oh, see, but there was the meter. It's gone in the now. Else is written on it. Those with spiritual potential can see shadows, forms invisible to the average person, the souls of the dead, vestiges of thoughts left behind in a place. My camera obscura was created to capture these clues to the spirit world, and I now have a chance to improve its capabilities even further. In the course of my research here, I have discovered that the materials used in mask making on Ragatsu Isle can improve the camera obscura's ability to capture those shadowy forms on film. I have also come to believe that the camera obscura holds a power greater than I uh, had ever expected. This is the power of the camera obscura to affect these shadows when photographing them. I read that sentence weird. It is something like the exorcism that those with spiritual potential refer to. It is my experiments on this island that have brought me to this bold conviction. I have decided to donate a camera obscura to the owner of the ho hotel. So is it a hotel or isn't it? It's it's a hotel museum <laughs> hospital. I, d I did not explain why I was donating it, but I cannot help but feel that there will come a day when this island will need the power of the camera obscura. I only... You know what? Hmm? You know what? It's probably a hotel that was converted into a hospital when something bad happened. Or something. Yeah, that that's a thing that happens. A big old, a big old tragedy happened, and they had to convert it. That I I could buy into that. You're probably right. Take it easy. Oh no, the camera's shaking. It's it's shivering with anticipation. See, okay. See meter meter. Yeah, I see it now in the bottom right there. So. Sometimes when I when it wants me to like look at things, for example, let's can I go back and just look at stuff again? No. So I press circle to examine, right? And then I get a prompt. It says circle examine, but the reach out ones also say circle to examine. So I keep doing this thing where I go in and then I come out cuz oh, yeah. cuz I you need to hold. Yeah, I don't know that though and how can I know yeah. it? Cuz other things don't make me hold it's circle. The meter in the bottom. The meter in the bottom tells you. Was it there before I pressed circle, though? Yep. Oh. All right. I guess there is a visual cue. I just wasn't seeing it. And but old... it's not a good visual cue. <laughs> yeah, no. It's uh... a tiny little thing that shows up in the corner of the screen. Yeah, obviously, if I haven't seen it this whole time. I was going to say before that it seems... Uh... Oh, wait, we're going to have our first ghost. Oh, yeah. We got to do the battle tutorial now. Pop in free. Wow! Oh. Music. The, that was the classic Where's noise. The music. <clears throat> camera obscura is a special camera with the power to view and seal away the inconceivable. When a wraith appears, you can seal it away by taking photos of it with the camera obscura. Triangle to take it out. R2 to take a photo. Uh, locking all hold L2 to lock on. Keep the camera aimed automatically. Perfect oh. headshot. Yeah, I locked In both meanings of the sense. I locked on and everything. It's gone. Yeah. Was that a person? Got my first kill. Wouldn't do you think it would be cooler or less cool if uh, Fatal Frame had like an Unreal Tournament style announcer thing? Where less. it's like multi kill. I think I'd like it more, but we are we are and ruin people. the atmosphere. <laughs> you mean the <laughs> the point system in the explosive comment doesn't? I I, <laughs> I feel like it's like the atmosphere is like so much ruined by default that it's like ah who cares? But Just go for the it. face on that door. Oh, yeah, there is. That's spooky. Shine your light on that. Maybe it does something. Oh, yeah, maybe. Can you aim your light? Probably not, huh? Like, yeah. It's not great. Oh, it's like... Oh, that... It's not great. The we... fact that you can worries me, though. Yeah, there's going to be shit. And that it's not great. <laughs> well, it's kind of... In, like, some areas, it's great. But, like, if I need to, like, look over here, my body is in the way. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna say before that. Uh, oh God! I was I was worried when they they showed the uh, the function where you need to shine your flashlights on things to be able to examine them. Yeah, hopefully they're just all like you. 
I hope you everything won't know is when just, you're in a yeah. room when there is something, but there it does have that little meter on the bottom that maybe helps. I guess I'm because it was showing up before you were even shining directly on the item too. Yeah, it like gets brighter as you get closer to it. Also, uh, ooh, that wasn't on me. That wasn't a hold prompt. You got cutscene grabbed. Oh, you're surrounded. No hope. Yeah, just just lay on the floor. Just this is time to give up. Take a nap. What the fuck? And when when things get bad enough, just go to bed. 